New at five, with the ongoing protests and events in Venezuela due to recent election results, local migrant shelters are reacting to the impacts these actions could have here on the border. ABC 7's Juarez correspondent Heriberto Perez has the story. The crisis in Venezuela continues as protests unfold and others continue to leave this South American country. And now migrants here in Ciudad Juarez are concerned for their families that stayed there. Sin duda que es, que es un hecho lamentable a nivel eh, social el ver la situación en la cual se encuentra la, la población de Venezuela. Father Francisco Bueno is the director of one of the biggest migrant shelters in Juárez, La Casa del Migrante. He said it is very regrettable on a social level the current situation Venezuela is facing. With President Nicolás Maduro said to continue as president of Venezuela, protests and violent events continue to rise in Venezuela. Los actos violentos pues nunca van a ser la, la solución ante ante los problemas. Father Bueno said violence creates more violence and the recent violent acts in Venezuela will not be the solution the country needs. The Venezuelan population living at La Casa del Migrante is concerned for the people still living there and for their families. They say the situation is tough. Pero no deja de causarles preocupación y dolor. Father ¿verdad? Bueno also told me some migrants living in Juarez are relieved because they already left the country. But the current situation in their home country continues to cause them pain because they remember why they left Venezuela and don't think the situation will change anytime soon. And I also asked Father Bueno how they see that situation impacting the border soon and what migrants who recently arrived are saying about a possible new caravan. I will have the details on what they are saying tonight on ABC7 at 6. Reporting in Ciudad Juarez, Heriberto Perez, ABC7. Thank you, Heriberto. Different news media outlets in Mexico have reported about a migrant caravan of hundreds of people that's been heading to north of the country or heading in the direction of north of the country to our border, but they have not said to which border cities they are actually planning to go. Migrant shelters in Juarez continue to be at less than half percent capacities.